How did Ichiro Suzuki become a legend in both the United States and in Japan? Let's find out. Ichiro grew up in Toyoyama, Japan, and by the age of 12, he had already decided he was going to be a professional baseball player. In high school, he was mainly used as a pitcher as opposed to an outfielder, and he ended his high school career with a 505 batting average. Ichiro made his Pacific League debut in 1992 at the age of just 18. In 1994, he set a Japanese record, becoming the first player to record over 200 hits in a single season. That same year, his coach suggested that he wear Ichiro on his jersey because Suzuki was such a common last name in Japan, and he thought it would help Ichiro stand out. That is why he always wore Ichiro on the back of his jersey for the rest of his career. After nine seasons playing professionally in Japan, he had totaled 1,278 hits and had a 353 batting average. It was after this when he would start his career in Major League Baseball. The MLB did not stop Ichiro from putting up big numbers as in his rookie season in 2001, he racked up 242 hits, 56 stolen bases, and had a batting average of 350. This led him to winning the American League MVP and Rookie of the Year. Ichiro would play 11 full seasons with the Seattle Mariners and be an all-star and a gold glover in 10 of those 11 seasons. This would be the prime of his MLB career, playing in almost every game in each of those seasons, and accumulating over 200 hits in all but one season. He went on to play six seasons with both the Yankees and Marlins, but wasn't the same player as his career was winding down. Nonetheless, Ichiro had been one of the greatest hitters in MLB history, and his career would come to an end when he played his final game with the Mariners when they played a game in Japan in March of 2019. After 28 combined seasons in Japan and in America, Ichiro ended with 4,367 hits, with over 3,000 of those coming while in the MLB. Ichiro Suzuki is quite possibly the best hitter the world has ever seen, and he is a true hero to many people in both the United States and in Japan. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing so I can make more videos just like this.